Student, today we are going to learn example 9.8 problem which is from the ray optics is for class 12 physics. Okay, there are three questions is asked in this particular question. Focal length is equal to 0 0.5 meter. What is the power? First question. The second question, radius of the curvature, one side is going to be 10 centimeter, another side is going to be 15 centimeter. Second, the surface is going to be 15 centimeter. The focal length of the lens is going to be 12 centimeter. Okay. They asked what is the refractive index of this material? Well, it's going to be the glass. Okay. So third question. So third question they asked when the same lens is placed inside the water. Okay. Now what is the new focal length? Okay. The focal length outside the water is going to be the uh, 20 centimeter. Okay. Uh, so when we place inside the water, what is the new focal length? And refractive index of water is given as 1.33, refractive index of glass is given as 1.5. This is the question is asked. We will be doing with one by one question. First we will do first question. Okay, This one. Uh, the focal length is going to be uh, 0 0.5. Power is equal to 1 by focal length. So power is equal to 1 by focal length. So 1 divided by 0 0.5 is going to be half. So 2 diopter. So first question answer over. Second question, radius of curvature is given, focal length is given, they want refractive index. So second question, uh, so 1 divided by F, focal length is going to be N1 minus N2 minus N1, uh, 1 divided by R1 minus 1 divided by R2. Okay, we have, we are using here convex lens, uh, first surface means positive, second surface means we should take it as a negative radius of curvature because left side to the, uh, left side to the optical center. So, R2 will be negative, R1 will be positive. Okay. So, this condition I am going to use in that particular uh, situation. <coughs> we know focal length is 12 centimeter, which is given in the question 1 divided by 12 centimeter. Refractive index of uh, uh, air only is a question, refractive index of glass only is question mark. So, second medium is a question mark minus 1. Uh, first surface is 10 centimeter, but next surface, okay, it is going to be 15 centimeter. So, which is given in the question, but we should take it as negative because left side it is, okay. So, minus minus is going to become as plus. So, uh, yeah, refractive index of R with respect to the glass minus 1, uh, which is going to be 1 divided by 10 plus 1 divided by 15. Now, cross multiplication we should do, okay. Uh, this is going to be 1 divided by 12. So, A to G minus 1, this is going to be 15, uh, 15 plus uh, 10 divided by 15 into uh, 10, okay. And this side 1 divided by 12. When we are doing cross multiplication, this will come here, this will come here. So, see here 15 into 10 divided by this 2 addition will get, will get 25. So, 25 into uh, 12, okay. 25 into 12. So, 5, five tables 3, this is 5, it is 2. So, numerator will be 6, denominator will be 2, this is going to be 1 by 2. 1 by 2 is equal to uh, a to g minus 1. So, we will have 0 0.5 this side, 1 by 2 is going to be 0 0.5 a to g minus 1, minus 1 when we are bringing this side is going to be plus 1. So, finally, a to g is going to be 1.5, uh, it is a refractive index of the uh, that particular lens. Okay. Next, uh, so next case, focal length is going to be the question mark. Uh, what is the focal length in liquid? Okay. In liquid, what is the focal length? Okay. In water, what is the focal length? So, focal length in the water is question mark, focal length in air is going to be given as 20 centimeter. Okay. So, 1 by F is equal to uh, refractive index of air, it is air minus 1, 1 divided by R1 minus 1 divided by R2, like this I am taken. Okay. Uh, so, this no, air medium we will know it is going to be 20, uh, we do not know this value. Okay. So, we know this value 1.5, it is going to be glass 1.5 minus 1, which is going to be 1 by R1 minus 1 by r2 the same length when same lens when they place inside the water that is going to be focal length in air is equal to uh, this value it is going to be 1.5 but the first medium it is now it is water okay when the light is traveling from uh, when the lens is placed inside the water first medium is water second medium is glass so water is given 1.33 uh, 1 divided by r1 minus 1 divided by r2 it is equation 1 uh, it is equation 2. When we are dividing these two equations, we will get focal length of the glass in air. Okay, sorry, liquid, uh, sorry, focal length of the glass, focal length of the lens in water. Okay, 
so it is in a water focal length in a water okay the final value will get as a 78.2 cm 78.2 cm okay thank you thank you everyone